said. I see. What's in it? He says it's for your eyes only. He used that expression? Yes, sir. Eyes only. Thank you, sir. It's just four o'clock. I know. As if you saw a bishop out there. A bishop? Do you think I would be this quacky if it had been a bishop? Now what is it? A lion? More or less. Papa is back. <laughs> back? Yes. He can't be back. Yes, go to his room, knock and buy him brandy. Am I that dumb? Then you believe me when I said he's back? He can't be back at 4.30 p.m. This time around, he is. Maybe there's something wrong. I think it's something. Maybe he's, he's ill or something. I don't know, Papa. I think it's something. I think. Think? What? What is it? I had the magazine when he walked in. Mm -hmm. he, 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 he behaved as if, as if. He must have seen the magazine, but he didn't bother to ask me. Papa didn't bother. Yes. Okay, I greeted Papa good morning. <laughs> no, it's not a laughing matter. No, it's funny. Okay, I greeted Papa good morning at 4.30 p.m. And you know what? Papa replied, good morning, my son. Good. You know Papa always sarcastic. Not this time, not this time. He, he completely missed me. See, he walked across the living room and walked inside the, the bedroom. As if I wasn't there. Oh, but don't underestimate Papa. He probably saw you and he decided to pretend uh, just to keep you unguarded. Well, I think so. Um, I guess you're right. I could be in trouble. Come. If there's the trouble of catching you with a pornographic magazine, then kick me out of it 
I've never seen it. You aren't you the person that bought it? What do you mean? You are the only person that knows about it. Oh. Papa doesn't know. You know, Papa now, look at the way you're talking. Any person caught in the art is always the Judas. So I beg you, I beg you, well, for now I'm the Judas. Don't just stay here, I beg. Just make sure you keep that in well. I beg, I beg you. Okay, that bought it. What what? When is your mommy coming back? I asked. When is your mommy coming back? Hey, Papa, you always told us. I see. You betrayed your guilt. I mean, the guilty are always afraid. Guilty are what? Always afraid. That's why I say you should make James Ali chess novels your favorite and stop reading all these pornography magazines. That's where you improve in your inspections. No smart at all. <sighs> Come on, okay? Come to think of it. Don't you think something is terribly wrong with Papa? Something like what? Have you ever seen Papa live over a meal of five eggs and plantain? Who knows, maybe he must be here. But like I told you, imagine Papa asking us when Mama will come back. Has Papa ever fallen ill before? Well, that's, all, that's always a, a first day. Of course, you know his body is not made of steel. Mm. If he has actually fallen ill, mm. it's worth celebrating. Look at this boy. Don't celebrate yet. Don't rejoice yet until he's admitted at the hospital. Mm. Mm. Mama. When a man is desperate, he can do anything, especially when everything is a stake. When he's hanging by the rope, it could be the end. When there's no hope, just like a drowning man, he will do all he can. To survive, to survive, that's a desperate man. Hmm. There's a life of a desperate man, a desperate man. Desperate, he will do all it takes. The hardest decisions he will make. When there's no. I'm sorry, my girlfriend is in there and I don't trust her. Your girlfriend? Yeah, she came and spent the night and I didn't discuss you. Ah, it's her. okay, it's okay, I understand. You must make sure you come to my office this morning. She's By the way, why did you switch off your phone? I didn't switch it off, my battery went dead. Then charge it. You must be in my office this morning. This morning? Make it 10 o'clock so that you'll be having a worried man. A worried man? I never know. I just be there. Okay, I'll, I'll be there. I'll make it. I'll make it. Just take it easy, okay? I'll be there. Okay? Hello. 
was that? Who else? Who else? I don't think I've ever met someone that goes by that name. Ben, please, the subject matter, okay? Chief. Yeah? So? And what the hell is he doing here? The idea of switching off my phone wasn't a good one after all. Oh. I see. You've seen nothing. Chief is serious, really troubled. And... That is the whole idea. You see, my dear, most men take others when their heart is vigorously troubled. Excuse me. Chief Dan Ibekwe is not most men. We shall see then. All right. Anyway, I have to just rush to his office and see him, okay? Excuse me. Yes, sir. That was a very smart idea. Secretary, who is finding it very difficult to remember anything about him. All of this? Yes, I don't know. That is why I needed you to help me sort things out. God, I just wonder what this country is turning into. What do you expect? When the whole American films are flooding Nigerian markets with the sinisters and both of you. So. Honestly, my dear, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Can I make a suggestion? What would you suggest? Call the police. What? Call the police and tell them what? It's obvious where this is leading to. And where would that be, my dear? This has every ingredient of blackmail. Blackmail? How could we be so sure? <laughs> Our different pictures different position, it simply suggests just one thing. And how are we sure that my wife has not received the same package by now? I don't think so. That is their selling point. And if you pay their demand, you'll be saving your wife the agony of receiving the same package. And if you don't, I'm sure you don't, you know where that leads to. Well, that sounds more like it. Yeah, it is. Now, who got into us? How would I know? You've got to know. Because I've never told any living soul about our relationship. So what the hell are you insinuating? Who the hell did you tell, damn it? You're in the office. Office? You're shouting. Oh, I tell you, Ritz, regular, and it's my office. I can very well shout to the extent that I want it. Now tell me, who else knows about our relationship? God! Not until I say so. Not until I say so. Are you out of your mind? Maybe. Do you know I could scream? Oh, go ahead and scream and break out the whole building. So who the hell was at the wrong place at the wrong time for those prints? God! Oh, how would I know? Don't you think the devil is at work and playing its game? Come off it. 
I hope you are not trying to play a comic game with this. Are you? <laughs> My dear, we both have a problem. Why single me out as the cause of it? Because everything that is happening to me is like a mystery. How could one man get those pictures? When we used the confines of the Monserrin Hotel room, how could he? Who planted the camera? Who operated it? Why? Well, I only know of one place where we can get all the answers to all your questions. Yes, my dear. Uh, which is? Maybe we can go to the coffins of another lovely hotel, make love, and think of another option. Are you out of your mind? My dear. When your memory, I mean when your engine is completely distorted, there is no other lubricant than the rheumatic fluid. And if your sexual desire is as vibrant as it used to be, I'm sure they'll be more than willing. Hmm. So are you suggesting? <laughs> My dear, don't die in guilt. This is Lagos. Every young man you see out there, or married man you see out there, takes a quickie, one or two, out of his matrimonial bed. Yeah, maybe. But not all the men out there have 36 incriminating exposures advertising their sins. You can't be too sure of that, my dear. Just get it off your mind. Hmm? Think like me. I'm sure a solution will definitely evolve. Joe, you see, sometimes uh, I wonder the kind of fibers you have as naps. They are not made of piano wires. It's just me. Joe, but how could you possibly suggest that we sink deeper into the negative side of God when our supposed allies outside there playing hide and seek? Don't you read the Bible? And if we are to observe everything written in the scripture, I bet you no man will step out of his house. I mean, even in the old, there was David and Bershi, right? Come on, come to me. Joy. So what do you suggest? Wait like a cow to the slaughter slab. I haven't said so much. Oh, you've not said otherwise either. You want my suggestion? Oh, you can bet all your life saving. That's what I want right now. Good. So why not just sit and wait till they make a move? Sit? Sure. <laughs> I mean, keep this away from the police and from any other law enforcement agency. Keep it away from your wife and your friends until you pay for the ransom. Ransom? The price you've got to pay for usually having your way through me. Yeah. <laughs> um, Joy, the way you talk about this um, suggests that you're accomplished. Excuse me? I'm accomplished to my own death. How is it your death? I mean, these guys can just turn around and turn the screws on me. Oh, well, I don't think, um, I don't <laughs> hey, think hey, so. Hey, even at that, what kind of a woman do you think I am? A prostitute? Uh, see, I don't follow... You but... don't follow what? What kind of a woman would like to advertise the next man she sleeps with? If not in a in a sinister situation like this. Okay, it's all right, it's all right. I think um, let's let's cut this discussion. Uh, I've had all you said, okay. Uh, now forgive me for my insinuations, okay? <laughs> come on, come on. Oh my God, see, I was. We feel one another one. We 
you've already started having to deceive me. <laughs> <laughs> this because he's our father because he yeah, I mean things are not right with him okay okay so how do we make things right for him have you noticed that papa has come I mean considerably changing uh -huh. so what about that okay papa is acting out of character and according to James and Liches, I mean that's a sign of intense pressure I beg you let's hear what okay Ike, Papa is in intense pressure. How do you know? How do you know? Intense pressure. Because he comes home at 4.30 p.m. And since when you started crawling, have you ever noticed something like that in this house? On a work day. Come on, you must have taken ill. You didn't choose that. He never, he, he never was. How could you be certain? Because I've not seen him call the doctor or other, uh, take any medication. Do you go around with him? Are you sure? Because I watch him I mean, I think they very good. Look at him. I mean, I'll, I'll watch him every now and then. It's not every month. He has to give you a grave. Because if he finds out, he's going to skin you alive. Look, let me tell you. In Papa's present state, he's more likely to find out. I mean, Papa, it's surprising that he left you completely free from reading a pornography magazine. Papa took a good morning at 4.30 from you. Oh, Jesus. I mean, that suggests that it is not Daniel Ibekwe that gave birth to us. I mean it. I think you're right. Chiniki. Good evening, Papa. How many times have I warned you that I never want to see this kind of book in your hand? But, but Papa, uh, uh, this is... Just a novel. Yes, just a novel. Yes, Papa. And uh, I passed my English language exams mainly because of, I mean, books like this. Please shut up. Now, give it to me. He is done a little quick, okay? First time. How is this? The door and rather felt something hard at the back of my neck. A gun? Yes, a gun. Exactly how did he look like? It's of no use. Come off it. If I'm going to part with a million naira, everything is of use. It's of no use because he was masked up. Mask? Yeah, he was masked up. He said in 48 hours, a million naira should be paid into his account. Or else your wife gets to get those pictures in her holiday suite in California. He said that? His exact words. Jesus, Jesus. What have I got myself into? Just relax. Relax? In 48 hours, a million naira is not too much for you to get. Or is it? Or in 48 you? hours? Yes. Joy, you wouldn't know how tough the financial terrain is presently in the country, would you? And consider what this will do to your marriage. When it gets the pictures. Hmm? One million. 
million naira. How can I raise one million naira without my wife knowing on arrival? that blackmailers are never associated. How do you mean? That they always come back for more. Well, I, I wouldn't know. I've never blackmailed and neither have I been blackmailed. I see. Whenever you see him, tell him that he should make sure that this is a one-way thing. That if he tries anything to squeeze more money from me, I will totally and strongly resist it. Just remember to tell him no more bites. Okay, okay. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. Okay. Thank you, Chief. Bye-bye. Well? I guess so. This, this looks too good to be real. <laughs> it's up to a million. I guess it will never be a couple less. I need all the prints. Sure. And all the negatives. That poor man is seriously disturbed. Joy, when a man is promiscuous enough to take a woman into a hotel room, then he's got to take whatsoever that comes after it. Point of correction, Ben. I am not any girl and Chief Daniel Ibekwe is not any man. He took his time coming. Oh! But he came! That is the whole idea. Oh, maybe, but I encouraged him. The poor man was setting off every discretion onto you. What is this on my foot? Maybe someone let to tell him that. There is no discretion when a woman is a father!
more cap too. We'll give that to him. Where, where are the negatives? I think it will be done to hand him over that, wouldn't it? What are you talking about, Ben? I've been thinking. Thinking of what? Why throw away a meal ticket? Ben. Let's look at it this way. Just do it. Two days. 48 hours. And he coughed out one million. What do you think will be the remuneration if he is squeezed for what a week will provide? Are you out of your senses, Ben? No. I am only being a smart Alec who recognizes opportunities when they come. Jesus Christ. Ben, you're just being insane. This wasn't the arrangement. Remember, he promised to resist any further push from you or from any other person. Then his wife knows. Jesus Christ. Ben, you're just being greedy. I prefer you use the word smart. Jesus Christ. You, you used me, Ben. I got whatever it is you wanted. You have more than enough. Can't you just take it, go somewhere and count your blessings? Ben, I am warning you. Don't bite more than you can chew. Let me worry about that. I will give him that. Consider sending the negatives only if he is absolutely sure he's safe. Is he mad? Come to think of it, he looks it. He looks it? Certainly. But you said he wears mask. Oh, yeah, he sounded it. Oh, Joy, what impression do you make out of this thief? I don't quite follow. From your impression? Do you think he's coming back to squeeze more money from me? I don't know. No, no, I mean, I mean, from your impression of him. Not the way he sounded. You want the honest Exactly truth. that is what I want. I'm afraid he would be asking for me.
Oba has a big, a big problem. A big problem? Yes. Why oh, is under a pressure? Papa is sitting on a pressure cooker. I can't want to sit on a pressure cooker. For real? It's, that's an inspection. Hmm? Oh, Jesus Christ. Iki, help your mental growth by reading book. Hmm? So what is the problem? Papa is under pressure. And it's rooting all over him. Come on, how did you know all the things you say? Eh, by being observant. Look, no one changes his routine just for the fun of it. Did you see the way Papa walked into his room without even taking a glance at us? Look at Papa that will, that will always warn us, uh, 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 us against playing computer games. You forgotten? I think you're right. I'm always right, you know. Come on, but why is Papa behaving the way he's doing? That's what we've got to find out. To find out? Yes. How? By observing him closely. I'll probably follow him. Follow him? Yes. Ah, oh, he beat us black and blue. He wouldn't know. He wouldn't know we're following him. He wouldn't know that we're following him? Yes, in crime book it is called telling. Telling? Yeah, telling means following someone closely without the person's consent. So how do you follow Papa if he gets into his car? Well, that's what we figure out when all the time comes. But I think we'll need the services of a taxi man. What? Yes, we will blow a taxi. See, see, see. Iki, Papa has a big problem. And he will not confide in us. And Mama is not in the country to help share his problems. So, I think the best thing we'll do is to put ourselves into his groups. How? Oh, I'm just watching. Well, just watching. Don't you ask too many questions. Let us use our prayers. Eh? Ngozi. Ngozi. Sir. What do you have in the kitchen? Buy some plantain, sir. I see. Uh, then serve me some immediately. Where is Okechiku and uh, Ikechiku? They just left us, sir. They just left? Yes, sir. It's alright. Just serve me with some food. Let's keep this grazing can in the kitchen. Gives a damn about what you fancy or not. You're using me like a lamb. Because you don't have a choice, girl. So what do you want? Five million. Five million what? You heard me. <laughs> but he doesn't have that kind of money. We shall see then. Oh God, Ben. Ben, you don't understand. Understand what? He lives on his wife's money. Fine. And that is the more reason why he will make sure his wife doesn't catch him. But five million naira is outrageous, Ben. Exactly why I'm giving him two weeks. Oh, God. Ben. Now, you listen, baby girl. I've been in this business for a while now. What if I don't know about a man in distress is not worth knowing? <sighs> so, what are you going to do? Go to his office with another envelope? Give him another envelope. Yes. Go to his office. No way, baby girl. So, how are you going to get it across to him then? And what would my dear hot pants be doing? Ben, you are one sorry ass. I hate. <sighs> Pictures. And the negatives? <laughs> I'm afraid. How much? I said how much? Said um five five million naira. Who does he think I am? The central bank? I tried pleading and he wouldn't listen. Shut up! 
You're supposed to have a... Is it my fault? Whose fault? Definitely not mine. How is it mine? So is it not that bad for one to have one beglet beside his wife? Go to the streets. You will see the multitude. All the men out there have more than one bedmate beside their wife. So how is my own robbing me of my investment? I'm so sorry, Chief. I'm truly sorry. See, Joy, being sorry does not solve the problem. It doesn't solve my five million. But me having a balance in my account does. You mean you're going to pay? So you think I want my wife to have a heart attack? But Chief, we're talking about five million naira here. Another 48 hours? No, 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 no. This time he said two weeks. Son of a bitch. What are you guys doing here? Well, let's go inside first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> in the movies. <laughs> Come on. Please, what are you guys here for? Can we sit down? Oh, sure, please. Of course. Please. Right. So, what's the problem? It's our father. Your father? What about him? Haven't you noticed his recent change in attitude? Oh, that. Change in attitude? Yes. I mean, like, leaving the office earlier than normal. Not having interest in things you usually do and stuff like that. Well, certainly you're right. Look, even I don't understand. Your father has suddenly changed in his behavioral patterns. Now you're his secretary. Yes, his secretary. Of course. Can you help us? Point the right finger in the direction of this sudden change in attitude. You're serious, aren't you? Mother, serious. He's our father. Exactly. I mean, we don't have any other father. So we try to help the only one we have keep in shape. So what do you want me to do? Help us, help him knock back into shape. Exactly. So what do you want me to do? Thank you. Who was that girl that visited him in the office today? What girl? I thought we agreed that it's necessary to help him come back to shape. Well, I haven't agreed anything yet. Look, girl, cooperate with us. I mean, you can't be the best of sectors if your boss is over the edge and you do nothing about it. Well, certainly he's not yet over the edge. Well, we all agreed that we help him since he's behaving up. Well, yes, but... Who was the girl that came to visit you today in the office? Yes, who is she? See, see, see. I mean, we can save your job if you help us. Do you understand me? Look. Look, you, you guys just have to promise me that this information is going to spill out. Jesus Christ. We'll cross our hearts. Well, her name is Joy. Joy? Yes, your father's mistress. I told you. I told you. So, what did she come to do? Well, she comes in and out where she likes, but her coming is no longer important. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. In fact, you are more than grateful. You see, we'll be coming to the office tomorrow and we want you to do us a favor. Open his office. We want to go to his office and we'll come to him. Your father's office? Yes. But that's impossible. Why? Because he'll just give me a life. Oh, 
Oh, Jesus. That is if he finds out. And I promise you, he's not going to find out. And if he does? Oh, Jesus. My father, will, my father will be very, very glad to promote you. Yeah. I have a problem. Well, just say it and let's see if it is within my jurisdiction. Um, I wouldn't come here if I didn't believe it's within your jurisdiction. Well, um, let's just pray so. So? I need funds. So does everyone out there. And that is why we limit our worries by, by demanding for collateral. Uh, but we have enough in our joint accounts. You see, manager, my wife is out of town, and I have this wedding transaction. And um, how much are we talking about? Uh, five million to be precise. How much do you have in your private account? Um, let's say 500,000 Naira. Just that? I'm afraid so. Mm, you should be asking for a loan then. I prefer an overdraft. <laughs> uh, well, uh, Mr. Ibiqui, not these days do we use that, that word too often. You see, the, the economy is changing, and so are banking principles. So, which one do you want me to apply? An overdraft or loan? A loan would be more like it. It's all right, I will uh, do that, I will apply. Then do that. Okay. So stuff in there. Right. Thank you. Bye. 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 Have a nice day. So, all right. Okay. Bye.
Sadi, it's open, sir. The office is open. Lucy, how many times will I tell you to always lock the office if I'm not there? Sir, I... I... I will tell you for the last time. Lock my office if I'm not there. Yes, sir. ever since you left with Joy. Oh, my God. Lucy. You know that I wouldn't have you as a secretary if I suspected you would not be trusted. I know that, sir. Now, listen, young lady. No matter how it happened, this incident must not repeat itself. Is that clear? I... I said it must not repeat itself. Yes, sir. Now, go away. What are you still waiting for? I'm sorry, sir. Excuse me. by six tomorrow morning. So I would like to have the keys since you will not be around. Uh, sir, I'll be here. You will? I'll be here, sir. It's okay. Just uh, lock up. Okay, sir. All right. Have a nice day, sir. Thank you. Deal. Yes, yes. 
Oh, come on. It's not something I would like to discuss on a transatlantic line. Ah, uh, you know. See, trust me. Trust me. It's a fantastic deal. Of course, I'm sure. I'm very sure. Yes. Um, the bank needs your consent for the loan. Yes, that's correct. Five million naira. It's all right. Just make a letter to the bank via email. Of course. It's all right, it's all right. Oh, come on, dear. This is a straight business. There's nothing like four neither. Believe me. Believe me. For mama, for a little five million dollars from the bank, imagine five million. Yes, five million. Oh, maybe he needs that for a business. Are you stupid? What? He went under pressure, is demanding for a little five million dollars from the bank, and you call that business. <laughs> what else could it be? Oh, you think you give it to that hall? Okay. Have you ever, have you ever heard of the word blackmail? Blackmail? Yes. Yes, of course. And what about it? Someone is blackmailing Papa. Mm. And why should someone black my papa? Wait. Take a look at this. Hey! Is this papa? Are you blind? Ha! <laughs> papa of all papa! Naked with this 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 harlot! Look at that is it. <laughs> that is why it's like a man. Give it to me. Come. Stop. I need something on you. Laugh. Don't be afraid. It's not. This is not This is not a problem. This is a very big problem. Uh huh. He's my child. As wild as Papa is, 
He wouldn't have approved of those pictures. You know what I'm talking about? So how come he took them? Espionage. Espionage? What is this espionage you uh, uh, always talk about? Someone is using those things to run papa. How possible could that be? Yes! There are secret cameras used by secret agencies. You don't you know? Secret agencies? Yeah, uh, yeah, um, like the CIA, um, Ma Mossad. Uh, let, let me, yes, the KGB, you know now. MYS and M16, and even our own SSS. CIA, Mossad, KGB, then Mossad, this, that. What are you talking about? I didn't say Mossad, I said Mossad and KGB. Mossad, KGB. So, what do they mean? There are secret information agencies that, I mean, do some job clandestinely. And even some other sinister things, which involves um, assassination, murder, and so on. Stop lying. Just stop lying. Look at you. Your problem is that you don't read. Read and grow up. Cheer up, man. Mm, forget it. Now let's talk about Papa. Yes, someone is using those pictures to play Papa black and white. What do you mean by that? It's Papa black and white. Yeah, they are slangs used by very popular, popular authors. We know what I mean. We know authors like Hanley Chase, Chino Di Kereza, you know, <laughs> Loris Michaels, and so, so many of them. And so, so, so what about that? Again, someone is blackmailing Papa. My wife is not got yet. It's one week to the time. And I don't have any positive hope of laying my hands on the money. So what are you going to do? The correct word is we. What are we going to do? Excuse me? Yes. Why we? Oh, we are both in the pictures. So? We face the scandals. <laughs> we face the scandals? What happens after that? We take it as they come. Two weeks I gave him as buyers, then I will believe that. Oh, you better start believing it now. Now you listen. I don't jump the gun. They believe this from me. Two weeks from now, I am going to splash the photograph all over the newspaper, including sending them to his wife. <laughs> you mean you are going to splash my face on the papers? You better watch me, girl. Who the hell do you think you are, Ben? Lucifer? I am worse. Naturally, his elder brother. Ben, what do you want me to do? Convince him to pay. I swear to God, that man doesn't have that kind of money. Why can't you just understand? <laughs> we shall see. <laughs> We shall see, baby girl. Waiting it be, we know no. 
We must find the answers to these questions that we ask. But now waiting they have to know Waiting it be, we no know We must find the answers To these questions that we ask <laughs>